I visited the only Nintendo store in all of America. When I got there, I was shocked to see how much Nintendo invested into the decorations around the store. There was a huge golden Mario statue on the way in, cutouts of Nintendo characters on the awning, and a huge Pikmin 4 display by the entrance since that was their newest release. There were also Pikmin hidden around the store, see how many you guys can find in this video. First, we start off on the ground floor, which was all Mario merch and general Nintendo merch. For Mario merch, there was a bunch of plushies, this cursed Nintendo bag wallet, and Bowser plushies. As for general Nintendo merch, there were board games, a huge catalog of Switch games, and this grand exhibit for all the Switch consoles that Nintendo offered. Yeah, the merch is cool and all, but you know what's cooler? The stairs. First of all, there is a gigantic Bowser statue coming out of the stairs. And next to him, a DK barrel with plugs so that parents could charge while their kids shop. How did they even think of this? On the way up the stairs, there's a TV with Kirby and his cute little friends waddling around on the screen. And get this, huge Toad and Luigi figurines leading you up to the top where you're greeted by Mario himself on the flagpole. So yeah, on the top floor, there was a lot of gaming stations with Pikmin 4 trials. There was even a huge TV where some guy was playing. Behind me was a Tears of the Kingdom teaser. And on the left was the long-awaited Pokemon section. There was Piplup, Arceus, Charizard, and a bunch of other plushies. Oh yeah, and they were also promoting their newest Pokemon games, Scarlet and Violet. Something that brought back a lot of memories was this display of all Nintendo's consoles. From the DS, to the GameCube, to the Switch, this was definitely a piece of Nintendo history. Last thing, in the Link section, an obligatory Link statue and sword. Well yeah, that pretty much wraps up my trip to Nintendo of America. I hope to go to the other Nintendo stores in Japan soon, and if I do, I'll definitely make sure to show you guys. Bye!